I travel all over the country and I go to a lot of great shows. But when they hear that I go to Art on the Square, their, their faces are always the same. They say, you lucky guy. For me, it feels like a privilege. There's just so many things that, that are happening all around you. There's, you know, all the different, you know, cuisine. There's the different great little shops that are on the square that people are getting to go through. And you walk around and you see into the souls of all of these really creative people, you know, from the high school students all the way to through the artists. And then just the enthusiasm from the people around you, it is electric. It's just an electric, neat, you know, weekend. And so for anybody who hasn't been, I really stress coming. There is a very highly selected group of artists. And I think the patrons understand they're not gonna see 500 artists. They're gonna see 100 artists and they're going to pay attention to each one. And so I find that they come in and take the time to really understand what it is you have for them. I think a lot of people really like to know where, from whom, they bought their art or their craft. Uh, I think it adds to it. Uh, you get to know the person who put his its own self in the piece. So that's and for us, I think I, I love to see where you know who buy my parts. And I think I I actually really enjoy the whole uh, art fair things. I like I enjoy. I'm working in my studio by myself for uh, the majority of the year. So it gives me an opportunity to be with people. I love the other artists and it's just fun. To me, it's the best show I go to uh, because it's run by a community that really cares about artists. They spend a great deal of work to attract the kind of clientele that can appreciate good art and buy it. You know, Belleville has always had a real quaint feel about it. But when Art on the Square came about, and I'm actually going to, you know, give a little bit of, you know, give some uh, props to uh, the Salute to the Masters that they had in Fairview. Um, and the Salute to the Masters sort of opened the eyes of the community and thought, you know, wow, this could really be something. Um, and then Belleville took it to an even greater level. And they have opened it up so huge and they've done such a neat job that I really think that Belleville is known as an art community.